like, oh my God, are you from Canada? Uh, I'm like, no girl, I'm from Michigan. We're, we're neighbors. Good morning guys, welcome to today's vlog. Today we're gonna be doing some car maintenance. I'm gonna clean the car and then uh, we're just gonna be talking about some stuff that we're gonna be doing for our vehicles for the winter. Okay, sorry for this really bad angle, but I don't have a car tripod right now, so I'm just making do. So, um, I'm getting ready to leave right now. I'm gonna go to my work real quick and pick up my check, and then I really want a Red Bull, but I really want to get a coffee too. So I think I'm gonna grab both. I think I'm gonna get a Red Bull, and I think I'm gonna go run and grab me a coffee too. Um, the kids, they have class, so we have class like all day until like 1.30. So yeah, we're gonna take and drop off one of our vehicles because it needs new tires. And then um, take the girls to get Halloween costumes. And I need to grab like a big laundry basket and just clean the cars out real quick and just kind of like wipe things down. Um, just because I'm not about to be cleaning the car in the winter time. Like I just never do. It's just too cold in Michigan to like just be outside cleaning your car when it's like 10, 20 degrees or less. Um, so that's what I'm about to do right now. I'm about to just start off by going to get my check and we will go from there. Ah! And I'm in like the noisy car too because this is like our little junker so it's probably you can hear how loud it is but <clears throat> it's turning beautiful fall here in Michigan. If you guys can see all the trees like passing behind me, they're turning like orange and green and yellow. And my absolute favorite ones are the orange ones. They turn like, oh, like a summery looking orange. They're just so beautiful in Michigan when you see the, like the leaves fall. I love that so much. <coughs> my voice is all crackly because I haven't had anything warm to drink yet. What's your favorite thing to drink in the morning? I know most people just go for water and sometimes I try to have like one to two cups of water before I have my coffee. But like my morning just doesn't feel complete like without something warm. Whether that be tea or coffee, I don't know. But tell me what you guys like to drink down below. James started drinking some tea. I kind of want to try like chai. I never tried chai before. I want to try that. This is a real representation of a road here. Like, the Michigan roads are so bad. Some of the roads are just like, so bad that you wouldn't even believe it. <clears throat> They're just so like, rocky and bumpy and janky. Really, really annoying. About to run in here into my job real quick and get my check. And a Red Bull. Ugh. I was thinking about grabbing the kids something too, but I don't think I want to. I'll be right back. Okay, so now we're back in business. I'm getting ready to um go. I'm about to count my check. I get my check through um my job does some kind of like um, cash thing like I'm on tech like I have um, like taxes come out of my check but I get cash I don't know it's some weird thing my boss does um so anyways so I'm now headed I'm about to go <clears throat> I'm about to go get me a coffee real quick and a donut because that's just what I'm feeling today. Because it's cold and I don't know. I'll get the kids some Timbits. I wish the car would heat up. So the plan for the vehicles is... <clears throat> I hope you can hear me over the heat. Let me turn it off. <laughs> the plan for the vehicles is... Um, our Fusion needs tires and I want to get remote start put in that car because like when I get out of work it's really late at night and I don't like having to wait for my car to warm up and go out there so I want to just be able to get it warmed up and then take off so that's like number one for me we're gonna get tires on that car and get remote start put in the car I'm in now the little car 
um, the tracer, it needs um, brakes, like super bad. Like you can hear them when I stop if I'm like at a red light on a regular road. So that one needs tires. So my check this week basically is all used up. I'm going to pretty much use my whole check this week just to get some maintenance done on the vehicles. Um, so that way that's squared away because it's now like November it's about to be the first week of November so we don't really have much more time like it's probably gonna start snowing soon so like we have to get on that and then um, next week I'll try to start saving again because I know a few of you asked about my um, cash envelope system I've actually ordered some new envelopes and like a new booklet but I'll show you like once it comes in but um, I'm really not planning on being able to really save much money probably until like the week of Christmas or like the last week of December like basically January is basically when I'm gonna start reusing my cash envelope systems just so we can finish getting some more of our business squared away that we are trying to handle so right now I'm about to just run and get me a coffee real quick I really like doing these vlogs where I have the opportunity to just kind of speak with you guys and take you along with me for the day I think they're like kind of fun because it's like you know what I'm actually doing as a working mom versus like <clears throat> a lot of vlogs and stuff like I'm not bashing anyone I don't want anybody to think I'm bashing anybody it's just that a lot of vlogs um, they're not real interpretations, in my opinion, of like how a day would go for like a working parent or a working person for that matter. Um, you can literally hear my brakes. That's how bad they are right now. Um, it's okay. We're gonna get new brakes. <laughs> I just wanna start bringing you guys along more for like the things that I do like as like an ordinary person and not just like a video that I put together because um, it's that setting. This isn't making sense. I need to wear that differently. Basically, I wanna show you how things are without me mapping out the routine, if that makes sense. Because regular days, really, I mean, yeah, I might get things done, but like they really don't go as planned, kind of like in a video, I guess, if that makes sense. Like it is real life and like what happens, but sometimes like things are just like so prepped and planned that like it's not realistic for like the everyday person. Now like you might be able to put those types of things together or have those types of days in your life. It's just that it's not like the regular, you know what I mean? Like it's not like the regular schmegular of like what really goes down. And so I would like to get better at showing you guys like what I do. Um, just being like a working mom, you know, a mom of two, I have two girls, like I'm married and you know, we have lots of crap going on. I feel like we're always trying to do something, literally, like, <laughs> I mean, I know that's true for everybody, but I feel like, I'm like, man, when are we ever going to feel like we actually got enough done? <laughs> Like, as soon as we do one thing, like, it's on to the next thing, like, every single time. And, like, this end of the year is so hectic just because of, um, like, paying off our debt. That really broke us, not breaking up our, the last of our payments. Like, it's going to be fine, but it's just, like, it really kind of offset us. We, we're in a position that we kind of haven't been in in a while, you know what I mean? Um... And I was hoping to like not be in this position, but it's okay because I know it's not gonna last, you know. I'm about to head into Tim Hortons real fast and could get me a coffee, a donut, mm-hmm, chocolate covered, and the kids some Timbits. Oh, my brakes are so loud. If people can hear it, I know they're laughing because they're like, girl. You need to get some breaks. <laughs> it's okay though. I ain't worried about a hater. I'm getting around here, right? We out here. We out here getting around. I got heat. It's cool. And the breaks are coming. But anyways, so. What have you guys been up to? Or anyways, outside of my dilemmas here in the vehicle. I've been talking nonsense. But. What do you guys got going on and planned? Are you guys ready for Christmas shopping? Like. 
Uh, I feel like I'm not. The girls are both, let me see what's going on. Can I get a large double double? Okay. And then can I get two chocolate dip donuts and a 10 pack of birthday cake timbits? Do you guys have birthday cake timbits right now? Yes, we do. Okay, I'll take a 10 pack of those. Alright. And then that'll be all. 674. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah, so. I feel like um, in the past, so like what I've did in the past, you guys probably don't know, is um, we usually give the girls like $300 a piece like for Christmas or somewhere around there. Um, just depends on like what's going on. But like I try to aim for $300 a piece. So it's like $600 and then like me and James just do whatever. But this year it's probably going to go a little bit over just because I'm not going to get them like a ton of stuff this year. Like they each pretty much want like a big item. And then like I'll give them some like filler items. And then of course like the necessities like of like the stocking. And then um, little stuff that they'll get like socks and stuff like that. I don't really count those as being like. Like they are in the budget but like they're not you know what I mean. Because like I have to buy those things regardless of if they're getting a gift or not. So basically, um, we'll see what happens with that. I'm not sure. Like, James sent me a few things too to get him. Thank you. a coffee I got Tim Hortons I know I've already said Michigan a few times but just in case you missed it yes I am in Michigan I know a lot of people always think like we're from Canada because um, like it's we have like the same weather and then like if I stop at Tim Hortons they're like oh my god are you from Canada I'm like no girl I'm from Michigan we're we're neighbors <laughs> I really want to go there I've never been there before I've actually like this lady was on um, Know what the heck she was on but I've actually contemplated going to Canada just to get my hair done before and uh, I don't know a popular thing to do if you're from Michigan is you go to Canada when you're like 19 because like you can drink over there when you're 19 and like go to bars and clubs and stuff so that's like a popular thing that people do but like I was pregnant during that time so I, I never got to go do that at that time I'm on the freeway so I bet my car is about to get like really loud about to just eat this donut real quick. person's gonna come cut my grass right now and I have a Red Bull and a coffee to get this day started I'm about to go in the house and um ill anyways I'm about to go in the house and like drink some of my coffee then I'm going to uh I think I'm gonna grab the laundry basket and bring it out here so I can get all the crap out of the cars. I'm not gonna be doing no major deep clean or anything. Like I'm literally just gonna pull everything out so I can just like wipe the dash down and clean the windows. And then like when we're all done uh, with the schooling and like all this other junk, then we're gonna take the car in and we're gonna take the girls Posting pictures on the gram so other people know that we're more than friends. Ever since you came around, I've never been sober, always in my head. Met you at a time when I was so low, went from just talking to taking you home. I don't want to go back to who I used to be, so if you ever you won't let me go
love was just like in the movies with a happy end yeah but sometimes you can't handle your emotions and i guess that's okay met you at a time when i was so low went from just talking What did it be? 
already after like a couple hours it's um it's like two o'clock now and the kids are now done with school so i apologize if this is crooked it's sitting on my dash but it's two o'clock ish now and i'm done cleaning out the cars um i vacuumed them out a little bit got all the stuff out and trash and whatever wiped the windows down at least i didn't clean the dash out in this car but um we just need to go i just ran out of time but we're about to uh take the car right now to drop it off to get the tires hopefully they'll take it today and we can pick it up hopefully either tonight or by tomorrow before i have to go to work so we'll see and then we're gonna head to get costumes right yeah what you doing back there Saving. That's a mittens. We're at the place now and we just dropped the car off. I'm pretty sure they're gonna keep it because he's inside talking to them. Look at your shop. So I think he's gonna be able to leave it. I don't know like how long it's gonna take or anything yet. I just got the kids in the car here. Which one's cuter, girl Sean or boy Sean? I don't think they know what he looks like. Sean? Oh, he doesn't wear any of this. Huh? He's bald and he wears hats. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah. What are you guys going to be for Halloween? What are you hoping to find for a costume? Sloth witch! You're going to be a witch? Unicorn! Or a unicorn? What's I your second choice, pull. Savannah, if they, no. if they don't have anything like a sloth? I don't know if they will or not. Sloths are kind of popular this year, but I don't know. Huh? What? <laughs> that's that's not doing anything. They don't know what you're... They're not, you're not saying anything. A creepy anything. thing. Mm, I don't know. With blue... Ooh. Oh, I'm definitely tired. Like, I really want some Rally's fries right now because I'm starving. I haven't ate anything yet. I literally, well, I ate a donut this morning, guys, to eat that donut. But donut. Um, I literally had like a 12 ounce Red Bull and then I had a large double double coffee from Tim Hortons today. So I definitely need like some food fuel. I don't know yet. I don't even know where we're gonna go to find costumes. They set up uh, like a spirit Halloween. Yeah, I wanted to go there. Um, that's probably where we're gonna go. Yay! It's not too far from us, so we'll probably go do that. I did have to make one more stop though, because I want to check this place to see how much it is for them to put the remote start in the Fusion. I don't know. Supposedly it like has remote start because we bought that car used. So supposedly it has some kind of remote start, but I don't know how to use it or if it even works. But either way, I would like to get it either repaired or installed, so we need to do that. And he's supposed to be talking to his buddy about doing the brakes on this car so he doesn't have to do them. Um, but if not, then that's going to be something else we need to do by the end of the week or something. Because the brakes on this are bad. Like, it's not going to be good having this car with these bad brakes once like the ground gets wet. Huh. Can I pet your dog? <laughs> That's cute. We went shopping for, what were we going for when we found that? My oh, coat. we were trying to find her a coat. And she's actually 10. She's wearing a small little um, packable puffer we jacket from Target. We went to four different places to try to find It's like a, a woman's coat. Yeah, we could Mom. not find a coat Mom. at all. Cause, Mom, huh? I want to talk to her. What? Um, Jordan still has that tooth hanging on for dear life over there. She yeah, won't pull it out. I'm, I'm, oh, here comes six. James. I'm six. Yep. Um, what was and I talking about? Coats. I forgot. Let's see what they say. My coat. What happened? Dropped the car. Huh? Are they keeping it? Yeah. How long is it gonna take? Until they're done. So is it gonna be today? Don't know. Probably. Oh. How much was it? Four hundred. Four hundred bucks. Well, Four sixty-seven. Four sixty-seven. Okay. Oh, well, we wait. Oh. All right, guys. I'm roughing it at this point. I'm tired and irritated now. It's like 4.30, 5 o'clock. It's already like, you can't really tell because of the camera, but it's kind of starting to like get a little darker out now. And Jordan. Hello. Hi. Hello. She appears fine, but she's getting cranky too. I'm not. Are you cranky? No. no. There's a bunch of crap in the car. What about Sean? Is he crap? 
It's basically all the bottles that we haven't been able to take back, amongst other things. Mail, mail, mail. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. Mail, mail. But what was it when you guys took back the bottles, though? It was like sixty dollars. Total. Yeah. When when quarantine happened, when the bottle machines opened back up, it was like sixty dollars that they got. Um. Did you take your bottles back yet? I didn't go. He took them. Huh? There's only a few states that reach your bottles. Yeah, well I mean, it, okay, if you're in Michigan then you probably took your bottles back, but I know all you guys can't recycle your bottles. What the, what it is, is in Michigan you get 10 cents on your return, so if you buy a bottle of pop for, you know, 150, then you pay 160 at the counter, and then you can recycle it back to the store and you can get your 10 cents back. And we had enough money in bottles to get $60 after quarantine and it was like a few months that we acquired bottles so that's cool Beer Halloween, here we come. Ow! Move your toes. Hey, uh, Let me see a Pegasus. That's what you're getting? Owl. Those are Pegasus. Those are owl. What are you Why getting? Are Why does it have a beak? Huh? What you getting? Hey. Let's go look. Mom. What? You guys move too quickly. Go. Go ahead, Jordan. What is it? It's earrings and a it's ears. It's snowflake earrings and a necklace that has um. That doesn't go with a unicorn. I don't care. Huh? I don't care. Yeah, I don't know if we can get this. What though. size is her costume that she picked? Let me see what size your costume is. This is too big for you, Jordan. You won't fit this. Like you won't even be able to right. walk in that. You, you got to get a different size. Try to get the unicorn. She needs a four to six. She's small. Oh, this one's too big, baby. You want to be a whip? Look at that. Turn around. Show me your costume. I mean your makeup. You got this. And some makeup. And are you going to get this laugh? And it's real. Mm-hmm. All right, guys. So we're finally back from um, getting the Halloween costumes. I showed you guys what they got. I'm like really tired at this point and I just want to like get home and finally relax a little bit more <laughs> So we're picking up the car right now from getting the tires And um, I'm actually about to get in the car I think and go pick up a pizza from like Little Caesars or something. You guys ready for bed? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You're going to sleep. Jordan's sleepy It's getting dark out as you can probably tell And I'm about to have to get an oil change real quick 
because that's another thing on the list right now. So we just left from the bell tire place. Yeah, yeah. Will you top everything off? I just got some new tires, so those should be straight. Um, I just left the tire place, and I'm about to get um, the car service a little bit. I'm getting all the fluids and stuff topped off, and getting an oil change before I head up to get some pizza and stuff for the kids. And James, he's doing keto, so he actually wants me to get him a um, some lettuce thing from like Jimmy John's. So. He's gonna get that. Do you guys use Carmex? Like the Carmex always gets cold on me when I leave it in the car. So that's what I'm doing right now. And the only other thing that I have to get done aside from that is just go get the other car serviced. But we don't got time for that today. We're gonna do that a different day. <laughs> that takes the cake. Jordan has, she played with her makeup. She put the jewels on her face. Where's Savannah? Where's Savannah? <laughs> I freaking love this. It's so cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed coming along for today's vlog. James is taking forever there. So I'm just going to just end it right here. And I will see you guys in the next one. Say bye. Bye. Bye.